Neil and David up in Northern California watching the news and seeing the four uh, students dead at Kent State. Crosby telling me that he saw Neil's face. He saw Neil go off into the woods. Neil came back an hour later and played in Ohio. Crosby called me and Stephen, who we were in Los Angeles at the time. He said, Neil has written this song, you're not going to believe it. We've got to get in the studio right away. Stephen and I booked the record plant here in Hollywood. Neil and David came down. We went into the studio. We cut Ohio. We cut the B-side, um, Find the Cost of Freedom. Ahmet Erdogan, who was the uh, president of Atlantic at that time, was at the s session. We gave him the master. He took it back to New York. That single was out on the street in 10 days. We killed our own single of Teacher Children, which was my song. And we didn't care. We didn't care about any of those rules. We didn't care about the record company saying, listen, you don't want to do this. Let Teach Your Children get up there, do its thing, and then, you know, a couple of months later, bring it out. What we wanted to do was bring it out instantly now. We were angry now. The kids were angry now. We wanted to speak and scream about this now. We wanted to put that record out on top of our other record, and we killed it stone dead, and we didn't care. The message in Ohio was very simple. When the American administration wanted to bomb Cambodia secretly, and the, the news got out, the students demonstrated at Kent State University against the uh, bombing of Cambodia. The governor sent out the National Guard, foolishly with live ammunition, and the National Guardsmen opened fire on the students and killed four of them stone dead. And that f uh, photograph of the bleeding boy with the woman, the young girl, bent over him uh, must be in, in everyone's uh, consciousness that, that existed at that time or have seen that photograph since. We were killing our own children and we were killing them in support of a secret policy of slaughter on a mass scale in Cambodia and the youth were not going to take it. They gave their lives to protest it, and Kent State was the very essence of the youth movement for me, was the very essence of youth saying, this is wrong, I'm going to say something, even if I may die, and four of them did, and that was the story behind uh, Kent State.